Hey, you're the two boy, Ike Samson. You know, good evening to all my amazing choosing one up there. <laughs> Listen, I have something special for us today. You know, don't think that they care, they don't care. Yes, believe me. Nobody care about you. <laughs> That's why you need to wait till the end of this video. It's not something bad. It's not something what good. But the two is what you need to understand. The truth is this, nobody cares about you. That is why you don't need to hacken or listen to what people are saying before you do it. You wake up and do what is necessary. Yes, believe me. <laughs> if you think that people love you, people like you to become successful, or you need to make people feel good in order for you to succeed, or you must surely impress someone up there before you make it believe me it's the worst mistake so ever yes you don't need to listen to what people are saying and you don't need to hack into their voice and you don't need to think who love you or who don't love you you don't even need to care whether they like you they don't like you as long as you are not hurting nobody <laughs> you know what i'm saying as long as what you are doing is not contrary to your way to your own faith it's not contrary to the will of God. So don't listen to nobody. Because people who will tell you what to do and what not to do, many of them have different what auction. <laughs> many of them are not even succeeding, not talk less of in what encouraging you to do what you are going to do in order for you to become successful. Listen, <laughs> that is why you need to understand. Wake up and do that which you love in doing. You know what I'm saying? Don't just wait and be expecting people to like you, you know, to be impressed by you or people to tell you hours for you to wake up and do your job. Look at it. You can hear the sound of our, of our, of, of my master, you know, despite of the fact that we have closed work and he's still there working. Many people are, you know, I'm just heading home to relax, but he's still there working. Why? 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 It's because he know that nobody care about what about the job. Nobody care. None of us care about the job. What we care is that once it is five o'clock, we do what we leave. That is just the fact. Truth. That's why I tell you that it's not something bad and it's not something what rude. So that's why you need to understand that if you are that kind of person who is interested on what people are saying or you are interested ah if, if i if i learn this job now many people will many people will go against it if i learn this thing now many people will not patronize me if i decide to be doing this job many of my friends will hate me you know if i marry this man which i love many people will do my even my family will not like me anymore even my brothers will not like me who give a damn nobody give a damn about what you are doing or how 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 hard is it is it is you versus you bro believe me nobody will ever tell you this truth it is you that own you nobody in this planet earth that owned you what something nobody in this planet earth that care about you all that they care is just how to use you to elevate if you if you are not inform about this just be informed about this all people care is how to use you in order to for them to elevate yes that's why i said it's not something bad and at the same time it's not something rude because if you are not ready to work with your own self if you're not ready to sacrifice for you to be lifted people will use you to sacrifice in order for you know when i was coming you know when i was going work today there's something that i imagine I said, there is a reason why, you know, people up there are becoming more successful and why some people up there are not. <laughs> you know, I'm very sorry to say this word, but that's just the fact. If you are able to do it, to wait to the end of this video, I know that you will benefit a lot from it. Believe me. You know, it, it looks like some people are succeeding and some people are not. Why? Because people who are succeeding are using those who are low self-esteem. <laughs> it's not that it's not a cause that's why i said it's not something bad and it's not something it's not a cause that you are not able to figure out that your identity because many of us don't want to start from late to beginning 
Many of us are talented. Many of us are what are equipped. Many of us have the mighty gift. We can think a lot, but how to start it is the problem. Because many of us, our thought is that ah, we must surely do it in a big way. Ah, we, we can start it little. We can start it small. Look at it. I was asking, you know, my my master, I was asking his brother, how come his you know his senior brother becomes so successful like this that he's also what a millionaire? How come? No, he started to narrate a word. He started to tell me that he started the work, you know, little by little. Even the man who was there when the man started, the man said that before they don't have something like anything like what uh, work in place. They just do, do used to do the onions little by little, little by little. Even they use hand, you know, hand to do it and all those stuff. But now we can't count how many tractors, we can't count how many trailers, we can't even count how many what. He, he, that was last last year. He 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 opened another what another what another fabrica. He buy another fabrica. He still building house. But when they were telling me how he started, I was so shocked. Believe me, I was so shocked. I said, how come he started that little and now he he make it to this point? And I, I asked him one day. He said many of his friends have quit. Even my master, you know, my master do used to tell me, say something. <laughs> you know, you are quite different from what, from your friends. I said, why do you say so? He said, uh, I can't tell, oh, but you know why. Why am I saying this? Not that uh, I'm trying to make you not to feel good, but I'm trying to make you to know that that small thing you are, you have in your forehead, that small idea you have, and you are thinking it's not good enough for you to become successful. Hey, <laughs> God. <laughs> you, you, you need to understand, you need to do what you need to rise up and rewrite that your word, that your you, you, you need to stand up and start a new thing. You need to stand up and do that thing which you know. Whether you know how to cook, you know how to talk, you know how to, you know, at, at, um, um, at, um, how will I say, entertain people, you know how to give advice, you know how to give people hope, you know how to do, you know, anything you can do. Is it business? Is it this? You can start with little beginning. The Bible, God did not tell you that you must surely start with latter end. He said your little beginning with God may be small. That means there is in, in, the, the must and it will start with little beginning. So what does that tell you is that it does not matter how little your what your little beginning is. What matter is you don't quit. Because each of the us on planet Earth have gift that we are gifted. Each of us are blessed. Each of us are what are, uh, are equipped with many understanding. You know, uh, I was saying a word earlier that the reason why they, they what many people are becoming what great and some people are not becoming great is because those who are becoming great, if you look at it, they are, used, they are indirectly using those who don't want to start with little beginning. They are using them to lift themselves. Yeah, you know, that was last, that was, uh, last month, you know. That was last month. It ran throughout. It's not my master fault. It's not nobody's fault. But when I calculate the money I earned in last month, I pay my bill and I do everything. I was like, ah. This is how life is going to be. This is how life is going to be. I was imagining what else will I do? What else will I put my effort on? What else, what, what business will I do in order for me to do what? To end more. So what am I trying to say is this. There is a lot in your brain. There is a lot in your hand. But that little beginning is just the problem. So my brothers, I challenge you, just remember one thing that you owned you. Just remember one thing, it is you versus you. Just remember one thing that nobody on planet Earth that owned you something. You own yourself something. If only you can just figure out this. Believe me, in five to six years to come, you will come back to this channel and congratulate God, not me. Be wise. Start up that business. Start up that what that, that school. Do not be what be afraid. Don't let people who 
who don't want to start up make you feel like your starting will end up in pain. Don't let people up there deceive you that, that your little beginning will not enlarge, you know? Don't let them deceive you. Don't let them discourage you. Keep going. Keep grinding. Because in God, we hope. You know what I'm saying? So remain blessed.